morning, Patty Elementary. Today is October 29th. I'm Jack Carney. And I'm Alexis Hart. We hope you're ready for a terrific Tuesday. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. You may be seated. Announcement: <coughs> Book fair is open for purchases today. Jack, today is going to be a great day. Book fair with the weird history of Jack. Did you know the, the whole population of the world could fit in Los Angeles? Wow, Alexis, that's pretty cool. Now here's yesterday's riddle. My cake is rather small. Perhaps you should have two. Oh, and I am a mug of Echo Jack for you. That's a tricky riddle, Jack. Well, to figure out the riddle, we have to remember that a mug can also be called a cup. Uh, and the cake part makes it a cupcake. Yes, Alexis, you're right. It is a cupcake. Now it's time for Teddy Ball Game and the Leash in the Patty Sports Show. Good morning, happy Tuesday, coming at you on the sports show. I'm we got some props this morning, buddy. I'm still trying to figure out that whole Los Angeles thing. The whole the population whole of the world can fit in Los Angeles. I guess if you go, you know, you just keep going higher and higher, right? Yeah, right, just stack them on top of each other. Until you're, until you're at the moon. <laughs> Google doesn't lie. <laughs> hey, Paul, uh, what's happening, my man? Houston Astros taking a 3-2 lead over the Washington Nationals. Astros have outscored the Nationals 19-3 in those three games. They look to close out the series tonight in Houston, but I say hashtag stay in the fight. Stay in the fight. Hey, man, it's all you can do. We talked about it yesterday, guys. What do you do when you're down, when no one else believes in you, when all odds are against you, when you're feeling down, too, and you're not performing? What do you do? Do you cash it in, give up, put your head down, cry, whatever? No, you stay in the fight and you do it. You bring your best. You may lose, but it doesn't matter. You gave it your best and you're going to feel better about that. So we'll see. Yep. Go Nats, wearing a jersey. Philadelphia Eagles hey. came through with a big win this weekend. 31-13 over the Buffalo Bills. Even up their record 4-4. Four four. Lots of rushing yards, 218, three touchdowns. Jordan Howard, Miles Sanders went off. Um, they face the Bears next week. Oh, that the hurts. Bears tough loss this weekend to the Chargers 17-16. What are you going to do? You're going to stay in the fight, right? In the hey, fight. one game the Eagles needed to win badly. They did. One win does not define you. One good day does not define you. you got to come back the next day and keep it strong and keep in the fight and keep working. So we'll see. New England Patriots clobbered the Cleveland Browns 27-13. San Francisco 49ers trounced the Carolina Panthers 51-13. Those are the two nice. only undefeated teams remaining in the NFL. It's exciting, man. It's been a long time since the Niners have done it, yep. so good for them. And finally, fantasy football news. Mr. Harrington took down Deluch. Teddy Ball I game. The fight. <laughs> Teddy Ball game keeps pace with Mrs. Cook with a victory over Mrs. Braxton. And Mr. Gilbert, Miss LaBelle, and Miss Mumford putting up big numbers. Each scoring over 130 points this weekend. Wow, Teddy Ball game, keep winning every day, uh, man. Just, That's what you do. You know what, boys and girls? Teddy Ballgame's winning in life, too, because tomorrow's his birthday. And that doesn't happen very often. And we no. don't get to celebrate Teddy Ballgame's birthday on the sports show very often. But we do today. Teddy Ballgame, you ready to play a game with me? I'm ready. All right. As we do with most of our staff birthdays, we have the opportunity for a prize here. Or it could be a game. Let's see what you get, Teddy Ballgame. Mmm. Trivia. Trivia! What are the odds? What are you ready to do this? I'm ready. <laughs> All right. All right, here we go. Teddy Ball game. With five wins and one loss and 18 total points, Real Madrid is currently in what place in the standings? Out of 20 total teams, Real Madrid is currently in what place? Five and one. Um, I'm going to say they're number four. That is wrong. They are number six in the standings. Ah. Too bad, so sad. Teddy Ballgame, you're going to spin this guy right here. We're going to hope we have the flavor because we're a little down here. We got Juicy Pear or Booger? Juicy Pear or Booger? Booger. Booger. I would want the booger out of that one. Let's see what you get, Teddy Ballgame. Uh, which color is it? This one here? I think so. Uh, that is Booger. Booger! 
Happy yeah. birthday, we're not done. Yeah. All right, let's see if we can keep a straight face through it all, too. All right, Teddy Ball Game. What probability in percentages does a team has when they start off the World Series 2 and 0? What is the chance that that team will come back and win the World Series? Um, 1.3%. Huh? I'm sorry, I, but you. Uh, <laughs> two wins, uh, let's say two, 95%. 95%. That is wrong, Teddy Ball Game. It is 80. 0.4%. That is the odds the Nats nice. have to still win the World Series starting off two. Oh, so let's see what you get, Teddy Ball game. That was, that was a terrible awesome. first guess. Like yeah. I just, yeah, I guess I, I wasn't thinking. Uh, the Booker went think, right to his head. Think, focus. Booker focus. went right to his head. We yeah. Booker went to my head. <laughs> uh, stinky socks or tutti frutti. Mm, 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 mm. Uh, Hopefully it's a football locker room NFL stinky sock. Tutti Fruity. Oh! Hey! Nice job. Nice job, Teddy Ballgame. All right, last one. You ready? I'll get one more. Teddy Ballgame. Named after the great Ted Williams, boys and girls. Did you know that Teddy Ballgame is named after one of the best baseball players who ever played the game? Ted Williams has what career batting average? It's actually ridiculous. It's probably over 400. I'm going to say 407. Teddy Ballgame, you got to brush up on your sports. Trivia, that is incorrect. He is a 344 oh, career hitter. I guess Teddy maybe at the end of his career went, you know, I, I'm not sure. Something like that. Just spin the wheel. Terrible guesses today. Um, we're going to go with peach or barf. Peach or barf. I can't even say it. Peach. Oh. Boom. Oh. Very nice. Teddy Ball gave him treated you well. Happy birthday, my friend. Thanks, man. Hey, everybody out there, have a great day. Don't forget together. We are Patty Strong. Let's do it.